Hey, it's belly off, fully loaded. Power trio is Monday's workout. So first, you're going to start with doing the two-minute drill twice. First time through, you're going to do it about 50% of your effort. Rest a minute or so. The second time through, you'll go about 75% of your effort. If after the two-minute drills, you don't feel loose, you don't feel ready to go, you can do some of the mobility drills that we put on the belly off site. Then, once you're completed with that, you're going to move into the three exercises we've chosen for you today, and they're great exercises. They're total body compound exercises. They're going to work a lot of muscle. They're really going to help you shred some fat. So that's why we've just put three main exercises in this workout for you. You're going to do them three sets each, straight sets. So you'll do a set. You're going to rest a minute and repeat. First one is going to be the deadlift. Set your feet about shoulder width apart. I like to use uh, split grip, so one hand facing forward, one hand facing uh, me. Big chest, I pull myself down into the bar, really pushing through my heels, shoulder blades back, driving and pulling the weight up, returning it slowly to the ground. On my first set, I would want to do maybe a weight that I could do 12 to 15 times. Second set, maybe 12 times, and on my third set, if I feel good, a weight that I can do just 10 times with good form. And that's actually going to be the format that you're going to follow for the rest of the exercises. After you rest a minute or two, when the deadlifts are complete, you're going to move on to bench. So we have just barbell bench set up. We get our eyes underneath the bar. We have points of contact with our feet, our backside, our shoulders, and our head. They never leave the bench. Feet never leave the floor. Pulling our shoulder blades together, we get nice and strong. Press the weight out, pull it down to the chest, drive it up. Pulling it down to the chest, driving it up. So once again, you'll do three sets of 10. You'll rest your minute or two in between. I wouldn't go more than two minutes. Try to keep it at a minute. And you're gonna move on to our last exercise, which is gonna be dumbbell reverse lunges. Just grab the dumbbells, get yourself set up. Step back under control. Chest is up, driving through the floor, alternate, driving through the floor. We do 20 total reps, so it would be 10 reps in each leg for three sets, and you finish the power trio. And then we're going to move on to some interval cardio. All right, so you guys can choose a bike to run, swim, row, whatever you want for your interval cardio. What's important is that you guys go for 30 seconds on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the hardest. You're going to go at about an 8. Then you're going to just come off for a minute on a scale of 1 to 10, about a 4 or a 5. You'll warm up for a few minutes on whatever mode of, of cardio you guys choose or whatever exercise you choose. And then you're going to get into 10 rounds of 30 seconds on, 1 minute off, followed by a couple minutes of a cool down. So let's say you have a bike. You get on the bike and what's really important is that you look at the screen and set your resistance. So let's say I choose 8. I'm going to pedal my 30 seconds. I want to stay above 110 revolutions for the whole time that I'm pedaling for that 30 seconds. When I get down for my minute, I'm going to stay around 70 or 80. So I'm on for 30, staying above 110, really pushing. And then after my 30 seconds is complete, I'm going to slow it down. And I'm going to stay around. 70 revolutions per minute for my minute, and then I'm gonna get after it again. When I'm done with my two minute cool, three minute cool down, my interval work's over. Monday's workout, the power trio is complete. You guys can come back Wednesday for your next workout.